Matt Musclewhite for IHateTheScene.com. I'm chilling with the guys from Reflections. What's going on, bros? Not much. What's going on? Let's do a quick introduction. Who does what here in this band? Jake, I'm a vocalist. Francis, I play bass. Charlie, we play guitar. Patty, I play guitar. Cam, I play guitar. Drums. Excellent. Now, as we're standing in front of this beautiful trailer, you guys want to explain what uh what happened here and uh, what all this foam is? Well, our band stuff. beat our trailer up. Or I the way up around. driving one time. Our trailer kicked our band's ass. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much. That's what that is. Yep. I don't know if you can see that on the camera, but it's, yeah. it's a pretty big dent. Yeah. But the main focus here is how did how did you guys fix this and how did you avoid missing any days for the bum trailer? Charlie. Charlie's Well we actually actually did fix the van. <laughs> for insurance <laughs> for insurance purposes. <laughs> and we bought a three dollar thing and I just started going ham on it and then I gave the rest to I wobble for their trailer. Because their trailer, as you can see, is like where they go? Our big brother. It's like Otherwise. it's like our trailer's big brother. It's like just <laughs> it's wrecked in pretty similar ways. So, but yeah, we've it's just it's three three hundred bucks, and I, it was probably two fifty to fix the wheel wheel bearings and stuff. And we've been driving it for the last what year and a half now. Yeah. So while. we've been saving a lot of money and renting U-Hauls. A lot of bands do that. And it's just it cuts cost, and we sealed it up so it's not leaking. <laughs> It's fixed. It's fixed. <laughs> fixed it. $3 from Walmart. We're on court fixed. Yep. It's fixed and they're still on the road. Now let's talk some more musical stuff. How, what is the overall theme of Reflections? Like, what can I hear on the album if I go pick up Exist? Huh? Well, lyrically, I think you'll just hear a lot of things about like, just real life. Like, it's not much of a, It's all. I write stuff about my day to day experiences and things I've gone through in life, so. Hopefully people can relate to that. So hopefully you'll find something you can relate to. Some real shit. A lot of heartfelt music. Like it's very dynamic. A lot of uh, riffs, guitar riffs that are fun to play, and a lot of them that just come from the heart. More simplicity, just for the overall emotion of the song and the theme of the music. We've also got a lot of. It's like really good, uh, really like ambient, clean parts and stuff like that too. And experimental stuff too with your friend Becca doing the singing yeah. too. That was something we wanted to try out. It's pretty cool. Yeah. Like the way they played out. Now you guys are all in your twenties and your young music career, when did you feel like I was good enough to play this kind of metal? Never. Never. <laughs> it still hasn't happened. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't know. Still we, we just yeah. love well, we, we just love playing music. This is just what we play, I guess. <laughs> what we write. It's just, we're always pushing ourselves. We're always trying new stuff. Like we'll take a we'll take a riff and we'll turn it into it. Go on. We'll take a riff and then we'll add to it. We'll expand on it. And I think that's how we improve a lot and we improve writing a lot too because we push ourselves um, in that way too. So I don't know. We're just always trying to strive to get better and to personally improve our life. Excellent. Definitely a fan of the technicality. What, what kind of rig are you guys are using right now? You said you started working with Legator? Yeah, we're using the Legator. It's a 5.65 right now. From XLS 1000 power. Um, I think 9.6 G90 relay. Yep. Yeah. 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 system and Legator maps. And a Furman unit. Yeah. Just yeah. for yeah. power. The power conditioner that lights up. It's all shiny. Definitely a fan of the Legators. We are too. <laughs> they, uh, they're, they've been really nice to us. They sent us cabs um, for a tour because we didn't have sufficient like cabs. And, I don't know. They, they've helped us in so many ways. How do you guys feel that you stand out in this scene of metal? It's like really crowded with a lot of bands. They're really doing like a similar sound or sounding the same. There's a lot of drown out bullshit. What do you guys feel you bring to the table that brings reflections that originality? Well, I don't know. I think we're not really, we don't really try to deem ourselves as anything. We just kind of go do our thing. And a lot of bands are really concerned with a lot of things and trying to match something or live up to a standard or something. We just like doing what we do. So I think people can see that in us, I guess. It's a real thing. You guys are real about it. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Any last words, guys? <laughs> it's no. cold. What is that? What? <laughs> it's chilly. Oh, it is kind of cold. It's, it's fucking effing. Pardon, pardon my French. <laughs> we are a PBS, so yeah, we can't swear. Yeah, is this going on uh, Disney Channel? That, like, little kid YouTube thing? Exactly. <laughs> kids, oh, little kids. Kids. Shoot. Shoot. <laughs> And on that note, Exist is in stores now, so go pick it up and check these guys out. Uh. <laughs> <laughs>